What's up guys? Learning with Rich here. Let's continue our discussion about Revisto. So this time I'm going to show you how to create a section or cut your building using the section cut tool. Okay, you can find it here. You see this icon, the shortcut or the keyboard shortcut is Control X. So let's do this. So when you click the section cut, you have two options here. So you have a plane, the other one is box. So let's do this. So let us use first the plane. So for the plane, let's say, for example, you want to start to this side here, just double click, and then you'll be able to relocate that tool so that you can push that to that side or pull, okay? Right, so let's say, for example, you want to start here at the top, so just double click to relocate, and then just pull down and pull up. Okay, so push down, then you can pull up, and then you'll be able to navigate your model. Okay, so that's how you use that uh, that tool. Okay, so let's try let's try again. So let's select new. So let's say, for example, uh, here this side, just double click. There you go. And then let's use the arrow here, pointing to that side, and there you go. All right, so that's from here. So you can just uh, select uh, new again, and then let's say to the top, let's click here, double click. All right, so just drop, and there you go. Okay, so I'm gonna close this one. So when you close that, as you can see, it's now sliced up. Okay, so let's try to select again section cut. Let's click that. So let's say, for example, I'm going to create a new one to this side here. Just double click. Push that. Okay, like that. And then let's say you want to measure. Okay, you want to measure this uh, ceiling height here or this ceiling to this floor. So I'm going to close this one. And then I'm going to use here the ruler tool. So let me click this one. And using this tool here, the Laser Ranger, so what I'm going to do is I'm going to click the top or the underside of the ceiling. Just double click and then you will now be able to see the distance. And let's say you want to check the width of the room. So you just drag that or you can also double click to that side. This one I'm just going to drag. Okay, you can drag that or you just simply uh, double click. For example, this side, let's double click, and then there you go. So let's say the underside of this uh, uh, duct, so that's the height. So you can use the laser ranger in conjunction with your section. So let me just close this one, and then uh, let us try more using the section cut. So let's select this one, uh, select new. So let's say, for example, um, this side here, let's double click. There you go. So you'll be able to push this in and orbit your model. And then again, you can do some measurement in this view. And you can also add some issue here if you want to create an issue in this area here. Okay, so that's how you use your plane uh, tool. So let me just clear this. Let's use the other uh, section cut tool, which is box. So you click the box. And then from here, you just click again the box and then you can now uh, click the sides of the box. Let's say here and then you can drag the top. All right. And then you can click that side. Okay. Just like that. Then you can push that again so basically it's it's like a box it's just a box all right so you just need to drag okay so that's i feel this one is more easier right to use okay so based on my experience this one is easier to use and then you also have an option here if you want to scale the box okay so let's click that so let's scale the box, you see, scale up, scale down. That's that one. And then the other option here is you want to move the box, so click that. 
so you will be able to uh, move the box see you can move the box you can move the box right and then the other one here is obviously that's a rotate so just click that so you'll be able to rotate your uh, box all right so let me just select your new and then uh, let me just clear this orbit again my model and let me just create a new one let's use the move let's drag this and then let's move it down and then this is the problem you don't see now your model so what you do is you use the scale box you click that and then you scale your box until you see again your model if ever you are lost and then after that you go back to your move face and then you will not be able to move again the face of your uh, box so just drag that again make it smaller make it smaller and there you go okay right all right okay so basically that's how you use your uh, section cut okay just remember you have two options one is box the other one is plane just click the plane double click and then you can use you can pull down and then push up your uh, plane there the other one is box just like that so here's your box so once you click the box so it will now get lost so just drag that until you see your model or just scale it in case you're lost just scale your box so that you'll be able to see your uh, model again so I can use this tool here move face and then I can just change it like that okay or just go back to your plane okay and then after that just double click a face so you can now use your section cut again all right there you go so that's it so that's how you use your section cut so hopefully you learned something from this video thank you for watching have a nice day